hi guys welcome back to my channel in this video i will show you guys how you can install wordpress on your hosting cpanel website with just one click so the first thing you have to do is to log in to your hosting uh, website and then go to hosting cpanel so for me um when you go to cpanel your cpanel should look like this and then all you have to do is to scroll down and then find uh, where this uh, software is located and then you can see a lot of softwares you see PHP I'm going to see uh, a lot of softwares CMS softwares you can use to customize your website so but uh, you also find WordPress you just click on WordPress and click on WordPress to take you to a page like this then the next thing you have to do is to click on install so when you click on install so you need to give it a time uh some time now the next thing now is you are going to choose you need to choose the website domain uh, you want to install the wordpress on so and then you need to add the http so if your website has sss certificate so now the next thing you have to give it a name so i can write something like my next website and then this is a near next website now here you are going to choose the username, create the username and password to log into your WordPress website admin dashboard. So I'm going to create a, a username and then I'll create a password. Now you can leave the uh, diff, this as the default email. So here you need to choose a default language for your uh, for your WordPress dashboard. So for me, I'm using. Uh, I'm going to leave it as English, and then the next thing is to select uh, the limit login attempts. You can uh, choose uh, to limit login attempts when people when someone tries to log in to your uh, dashboard and they input incorrect uh, credentials. So maybe after like five times, WordPress will automatically log those people out just to prevent hackers from hacking your website. So the next thing is to click on the advanced options. So here you can you can set the, the database name, uh, the table prefix, and some other features like that. So but I'm going to leave it as default. Then the next thing is to uh, is choose which uh, team you want to install. So these are some free WordPress team. So I can choose any of these. So I can select team, then click on yes, then click on install. So the installation will begin and you need to give it a wait for some minutes. So as you can see, the website is installing now. So you need to hold on and wait for the installation to complete. So as you can see the installation is done. Now the next thing now is to check if WordPress actually installed on my website. So I can click here and check and then I can try to log into my dashboard. So as you can see, uh, WordPress is successfully installed on my website and then I can try to log in to my uh, admin dashboard by pressing forward slash WP admin. admin. So I can press enter and then it will take me to the page to log in. So I put my username and my password. Then I can click on login. So this should take me to um, to my WordPress dashboard where I can actually customize and edit the theme and the template of the website. So so if this video has been helpful to you, please subscribe to my channel and click on the notification bell so it gets notified anytime I publish new videos in future. Thank you.